Hello yogis, Lauren here from Lotus Yoga Studio and I wanted to offer you a few things to help release wrist, hand pain, neck and shoulder pain that is related to using our devices. So when um, I'm teaching yoga, I often will start from the head down as we're starting to kind of warm things up. So first we'll begin with the eyes closed. And by closing the eyes, we're kind of giving them a little bit of break from the screen. And we're going to start to circle the eyes, just really starting to open up, release tension in the eye socket, and circle the other way. And this is a good exercise to do even throughout your day if you've been spending a lot of time on your devices. Just that little break for the eyes is really nice. So then we'll start to move the jaw, open, close, little side to side. Maybe it needs a little massage. So we're working our way down. Next is the neck. So we'll take a little side bend. And while you lean to one side, roll the shoulder that you're moving away from. And just gently start to loosen up those muscles. Good. and then we'll pause here. We're gonna take it a little deeper. You're gonna bring this hand behind the back. And we'll take a few breaths here. Mm, that feels good. Releasing all the way from the eye, the ear, the jaw, the neck, all the way down to the shoulder. And then we're going over to the other side. So bring your head to the other side and you'll just start to move the shoulder that you're leaning away from, roll that in a few circles, both directions if needed. And we'll just pause, feel that stretch, and then take it deeper, bring this hand around the back, and just sort of relax here. This is not my dominant side, so it doesn't feel as tight as the other side. Um, if you are particularly tight on one side, I encourage you to hold that side just a little bit longer so that you can uh, really start to undo some of that. Because if you're tighter on one side, it means we're using it more. It's going to take more time to undo what is holding on there. So now that we're starting to work down here, let's get into the neck a little bit more. So we're going to take it in some full circles. And the head isn't heavy. The head is trying to be light here so that we really are focused more on just range of motion in the neck and fluid movement. And we're not as focused on like a full deep stretch in any direction. And then we slowly go the other way. Deep breaths, releasing stress. and coming back to center. All right, we'll get into those shoulders a little more. So we're gonna bring the arms out. This is called cactus arm. And we're gonna draw those elbows back, pull the shoulders all the way back. And then on the next exhale, you're gonna bring your elbows all the way together. So inhale, you're gonna open it all the way up, pull the shoulder blades back, and exhale, bring it together. Good, I'm gonna show you what this looks like from the back so you can see what my muscles are doing. So you're gonna inhale, pull the shoulder blades all the way back, and then exhale, pull the elbows together. And you can really see how I'm trying to keep my elbows at the height of my shoulders. And by keeping the elbows at the height of the shoulders, I'm targeting um, the muscles that I really want to. Good, so then we'll bring it out open to the side. Just pause here, see if we can pull the shoulders down a little bit. Just feel that length coming into the top of the shoulders and the neck. Now we're gonna reach back. If it's available to you, interlace your fingers. Otherwise, maybe just hold a towel between your hands. And we're gonna start to lift those hands back behind us. And we're gonna take five breaths here. Inhale, exhale, inhale, Exhale. Last two breaths. And 
and then we'll release the arms and just let them come onto the onto the knees, onto the lap, and sit up really tall. Just noticing how we're feeling. And then we're gonna to start to get down into the wrists. So when we're holding our devices, the pain actually starts in the hand and starts to work its way all the way up. And to release it, we're working our way down. So from here, we're gonna take our fists, elbows at the height of the shoulders, just like we did before. And we're gonna just start to move the forearms in circles, just giving the elbows a little lubrication and going the other way. Good. And then we're gonna do the same thing with just the wrists. So we're just moving those wrists in circles. And the other way. Spread the fingers wide, close them tight. Spread the fingers wide, close them tight. Use your breath, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, hold here. We're gonna interlace and press those palms forward. Good, it might feel good to do a little side to side neck stretch here as you press through the palms and through the wrists. Good, and then we'll bring the arms back and we'll make some circles with the fingers out. Let the fingers kind of move and get incorporated in this, like a little spirit finger <laughs> movement. And then we're gonna reach all the way up and just lift, 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 lift. And draw the palms down to the heart. And give yourself a moment to just settle. This is another way that you can stretch out your wrist, pressing the palms down and then lifting them up. So that might feel good too. Can also feel really good to one at a time, gently pull on and stretch your fingers. And especially if you've been typing or if you've been using a smaller device like an iPad or a phone, um, this is a really nice one to release tension. And I'm kind of pulling with a little bit of pressure so that the muscles are feeling a release as I do it. Then we're gonna shake it out, shake it out, shake it out. Ah. Just notice if there's any tension still and if there is, instead of giving it a deep stretch, we're just gonna give it a little massage, just sending the body some love and nurturing, some gratitude for all that the body does for us. Thanking our eyes for seeing and looking at the screens, thanking our jaws for letting us speak and communicate, our necks for holding our heads up and keeping us steady. Thanking our arms for everything we hug, everything we touch, everything we hold. And there we are. Just a few minutes and we've released that tension. Feel free to do this whenever you need to throughout your day so that you feel as good as you possibly can while you are working from home. Namaste.